guys, today I'm going to be doing a current favorites video and I have a special guest as you can tell. This is Tika. <laughs> um, sorry, she's just going to probably sit on my bed because she's been on my bed all afternoon. So if she does weird things back there, I'm sorry about her. But she really wanted to be in the video. She's giving me a really weird stare right now. She's a really, really weird dog. Today I'm going to be doing, as I told you guys, my current favorites because I... I guess this is kind of like a combination of May favorites and current favorites because I just thought it was a little bit late to do put up my May favorites and now I have some things that I'm liking that I bought past May. So, you know what, it's just current favorites. I guess that's what I'm going to call it. So, um, I have just a few makeup products. Most of my stuff is not makeup. So, I do not want to make this a 20 minute long video and I'm also like... I have to go to dinner. My friend's picking me up in 14 minutes. Let's go ahead and get started with the few makeup products that I do have. So my first, I have talked about it before, is my Inglot palette that I made at IMAX. This is five eyeshadows that you can personally, it's called the Freedom System, and you can put in whatever colors you want. Um, they have a website, so just Google Inglot or whatever if you want to make a palette. And um, they only have a few stores, but I would so highly recommend Inglot. It's very inexpensive um, compared to other high-end brands for amazing, amazing quality. The one I've mostly been liking is this white one here and this one on the end. Those are probably my favorites. This is my inner corner color. It's a lot more shimmery. It doesn't really show up with the shimmer on my camera. And then this one is just a gorgeous, like, neutral, like, purpley taupe color. So, I'm wearing this right now, not sure if you can tell, probably not, but it's very natural and I've literally been just reaching for this like almost every day. Another makeup product is something I have rediscovered this month and that is thanks, thanks to um, Rachel who's I Call It Ambrosia on YouTube. I will link her down below because I love her so much. She is, all, she is so hilarious and she's probably like my favorite YouTuber of like May and right now. Like I'm just obsessed with her. I watch every single one of her videos. She is so funny. So I will link to her down below. She's 87 days before on Twitter and Tumblr though. Um, and she did a video where she um, talked about how she does her wings liner and she used MAC Black Track Flu Line and I happened to own this and I had just been using liquid liner and I decided to try this after watching her video and I've been using it I haven't been winging my liner every day, but I have been doing it a lot. Today I had my senior um, portraits done, so I wanted to kind of define my eyes. Um, anyway, I'm talking too much, but this is just the Black Track Fluid Line Gel Liner, and I use it with a little tiny um, eyeliner brush from Sigma, and I would recommend a really small brush because you can get a precise line and just do your wing really well. So um, I will also link to that video down below if you guys want to know how I've been attempting to do my wings liner. I've been kind of improving every day, so... Um, I really like this and I've been using this again thanks to her. My next product is something that I just bought last weekend at the drugstore and I have been hunting this down for weeks. It like I went to so many drugstores, couldn't find it. I looked even online a few weeks ago, couldn't find it. Finally, my Target and Ulta got this in stock. Um, and this is the Maybelline Mega Plush Volume Express Mascara. It's from the same line as like the Falsies and the Colossal. They made another one and this is the packaging. A lot of you guys have been asking me how I liked this. I like did a uh, Insta haul with this on Instagram and um, a lot of you guys have been asking me what I think of it and I really really like it. I'm not positive if it's like um, my new favorite mascara. I've been using it like every day and really really liking it. So um, I would highly recommend this especially because it's especially because it's pretty cheap so um, I think it's great. This is what the brush looks like if you are wondering. I really like the brush. It's a really wet formula and I really enjoy the brush and I think it lengthens, separates, and volumizes like all evenly and all really well so um, I might do a review on this once I try it out a little bit longer since I only have had this for I think six days. I feel like the lighting isn't very good in this video and I'm really sorry I have my light on me but like it's really like kind of washing my whole self out because of this window back there. Anyway, I'm sorry about that. I know the lighting is not amazing. It's better when I film at night, actually. Um, anyway, my last makeup product is something that I talked about in my last favorites video. It's my Jack Black Intense Therapy Lip Balm in Natural Mint. And this is SPF 25. This is an amazing, super moisturizing um, lip balm. It has shea butter in it, and I love the mint taste of it. It's like sweet mint, and it also has SPF 25, as I said, which is really great for the summertime. So you can just, I've literally just been wearing this. I keep it on my bedside table, um, which you can't really see right now. And I just put it on literally so many times a day, and um, 
this is my new favorite chapstick like I reach for this so much I think I'm gonna have to buy a new one really soon because I'm like almost done with this so I would highly recommend this in the flavor natural mint to you guys you can get this at Sephora for like seven dollars I think oh my god Tika is licking her paw she's trying to be cute so my next products that was all the makeup products my next stuff is I am so excited to talk to you guys about these two products but mostly this in general so I have found the solution to my tangly hair that nothing could fix I tried so many products for my tangly hair and I found the solution so this is called the wet brush and um, you can get this on Amazon I'm not sure where else but for sure Amazon and um, they come in a bunch of different colors it's about eight dollars and it's this brush that you can use on your wet hair to detangle it. It has these kind of different, very thin bristles that is safe to use on your wet hair. I physically cannot use a comb on my wet hair. It doesn't work. It literally rips out my hair and does nothing for me. And then even if I used a regular brush, it would take me so long that I just like would give up. This makes it so much easier, and also my friend Lorelai came over and she used this and she was like, oh my god, like I need that wet brush. <laughs> um, so I, uh, she was really impressed with it as well because she has tangly hair too. So I would highly recommend this to any of you guys that struggle with tangly hair. Like seriously, I cannot recommend this product enough. This is like my number one favorite of the whole May right now and then another product that's really been helping me this is the BB the um, bumble and bumble prep she um I love this stuff my hairstylist or hairdresser uses this on me at the salon and you can spray so much of this like you can spray it on your roots everywhere it doesn't make your hair greasy it has like vitamins and conditions your hair and it also um, preps it for blow drying or styling and it also detangles really well so I have been using this so much and you can use a ton of sprays and it doesn't use that much product so I have been loving this along with my brush for detangling. Um, really, really like this product. My favorite scent of May and right now, I basically use this every day, is my Viva La Juicy um, perfume. I have used so much of this. If you can tell, it's like uh, probably two-thirds of the way gone. And I guess I've had it since January, so I guess that's not like that amazing. But I really do use this every single day. I think it's my... I'm pretty sure it's my favorite perfume like I it just smells so good and I'm obsessed with the bottle and I guarantee by the end of summer I'm gonna be done with this and probably have to buy a new one because I love it so much so if you are in need of a new perfume I really would recommend Viva La Juicy I just I always reach for that like over all my other scents okay so my next product is something I'm so excited to talk to you guys about and Okay, truthfully, not gonna lie to you guys, I bought this product yesterday and the first time I used it was today, but I was so amazed that I have to include it in this video. Okay, it's the Sally Hansen Airbrush Legs. I had heard about this from YouTube, but I hadn't heard any like super raving about it, just that it's kind of like a good product. This is amazing. It's um, This is in medium glow for light to medium skin tones and it's called Leg Makeup. Okay, what you do with this is it you are supposed to spray it on your hands and then you rub it on your legs. It's a little bit difficult to apply, but um, you just have to be quick with it. Like you just spray it on your hands and you have to rub it really quickly. But I didn't really have any problems with that. Like I kind of discovered that on like the first spray. Um, and I rubbed it all over my legs and you rub it on the tops of your feet. It gives you this amazing glow that's like you just applied um, self tanner. It seriously looks like you were tanning like your legs in the sun all day and you got a really really natural tan and it just makes like my freckles kind of blend in and it makes everything I wish I could show you guys my legs right now it makes everything look so even and perfect now I got this at Walgreens and I paid a lot for this I think I paid $14 and I was not happy about that but I wanted it so bad so I'm sure you can get it for cheaper at probably like Target or Ulta, but I was just at Walgreens yesterday, but I'm so, so amazed with this. They also have one for darker skin tones, so I know I'm talking about this a lot, but seriously, you guys, if you need something like this, um, it seriously makes it look like you just put on like your self-tanner. It was so quick, easy, and it's still, it's like lasting the entire day for me, so I'm really, really impressed with that. Another thing that I've been really, really obsessed with as of recently is curling my hair with my Remington... Um, I believe it's called the Clipless Curling Iron. I'm not sure the correct name, but it doesn't have a clamp. It's pink, and this is a larger one. They make a smaller one, too, but I am I personally kind of like the look of, like, waves like I have today. Um, I used this today, and I used it a few in my 
videos that I did earlier in this week, um, I had my hair curled with this as well. And I've just been obsessed with it. It doesn't take that long. It probably takes me 15 to 20 minutes, which that really isn't super long. Um, and it creates these waves that kind of last the whole day and I really like it. Let me know in the comments if you guys want a hair tutorial and I have no problem doing one showing you how I use this. Um, but I would highly recommend this curling iron. It's about $25 to $30 and I just, I love it. My next favorite is something really, really random and you guys are probably going to be like, okay, this is the randomest thing ever. Um, it's a cup and it's actually a tumbler which means it comes with a straw and um, a top to it but I've just been drinking it like this because I have been since you guys know I have mono and um, also for my skin I have been on so many pills that I have to take like vitamins and just all this stuff to help me get better that I literally have to take like 20 pills a day or something um, a lot of them are smaller but I have to take so many pills so I've just been refilling this constantly with ice water if I didn't already say it's Lily Pulitzer I don't know um, my brother got me this for me for Christmas and um, it, I just think it's the cutest thing ever it's really big and it has these cute little flowers on it and I just think it looks cute in my room and I don't know I just would recommend this to you guys I think he got it at like Dillard's or Macy's or something but you can get them on the website probably as well so I just think this is really cute um yeah I just really like that and you can put the straw in it and stuff and take your drinks places with you. So that is all my favorites that I have and then I just wanted to tell you guys a couple other favorites that I have and I'm wearing them so this video is almost over I swear. So these rings are one of my favorites and these are I believe they're called the garden party rings from Jewel Mint um, and I've been wearing these literally like every day. They just are gold and I've been wearing so much gold jewelry. Um, I don't even like wear silver jewelry anymore so these go with like everything I wear because they have these cute little flowers and they're just a lot of colors so look up the garden party rings on Jewel Mint if you're interested in these if you're wondering my nail polish it's significant other color by OPI I did it last night and I'm in love with it this is a BCBG um, fearless bracelet now you can get these I had to google it um, you can get them I got it on the Dillard's website not sure if you get, can get them on the BCBG website, but I don't know what stores you can get it at. I just got it online. And I've been wearing this so much, it matches really good with my Michael Kors watch. And then I just wear some like other gold bracelets. But this is definitely, um, I've been wearing this literally like every day. So I like that it says Fearless because Fearless um, makes me always think of Taylor Swift. And she's one of my idols. She's my favorite singer. And the Fearless album is one of my like top three albums of life. So um, I just really, really like this. I know I keep showing it to you guys, but it's just gold and it says Fearless. And then they move around, but they're kind of like, they have these little things so they don't move that much. So I would highly recommend this if you guys, they also have other sayings. Um, they have a few other cute sayings, but I think this is the best one. I don't know. So <laughs> that was kind of a, I was felt like I was kind of rushing. What time is it? 551 okay crap anyway I'm really out of breath sorry if I am sounding out of breath but that is about it I hope you guys enjoyed this video I don't want to keep you so just check out all my links in the down bar um, check out my second channel I've been posting some more videos on there I have a new tag on there so that will be linked in the down bar and what else that's it so I hope you guys have an amazing day or night and I'll see you very soon in my next video bye do you guys say bye Oh my god, she's so confused.